Okay, season one of The Good Cop, which has a confusing name because there's actually a bunch of series. The Good, Witch, Wife, Guys, blah, blah, blah. So, originality. But anyways, uh, Tony Danza back. Ooh. And, you know, it's really... <laughs> Bad for me to see Tony Danza doing stunts at his age, and he's healthier than I am. Um, but anyways, he's still got the same old mannerisms from Taxi too. It's it's some things never change. He keeps his little his little history alive. Um, so it's basically about this goody goody two shoes cop who. father is a bad guy and cop because of course only bad cops were in you know the generation before my baby boomers were the last generation of bad people anyways there's some things that now that may or may not be true I mean I it, out here in California, a parole agent is a separate entity, a, a section under the Department of Corrections, and they're basically correctional officers, just a different branch under the correctional officers, and they also have an internal affairs department too, but they're not. Anyways, in this show, because it's set in New York, they have the parole officer as a police officer who's an inspector you know once again another difference an inspector in LA is basically essentially almost like an internal affairs uh, type thing that they don't actually arrest people they watch the cops and they make sure the cops don't mess up like my, my grandfather was a postal inspector when he retired uh, he retired from the post office as an inspector, which was basically if an incident occurred uh, with postal property, like a, a post truck got into an accident, and uh, he was there and he did the reports and stuff, but he didn't deliver mail. So, anyways, I'm not sure how realistic these things are. So, I mean, I have seen a lot of cop shows, and so many set in New York, and I don't remember ever seeing a parole officer going from inspector to detective. I actually thought to be an inspector, you had to have attained a certain level already. Not necessarily a rank, because you detectives and can be multiple levels. And, anyways. But that's the, that's the reality aspect. We're dealing with the show aspect, the hairstyles, um, wardrobe, continuity. Well, nothing jumped out at me. Uh, I did have a headache for two days, three days now, but so it may have uh, impeded a little of my, it didn't impede my entertainment. I enjoyed the show. Um, it, it's a dramedy, so there's hijinks and hardship all mixed together. It's, you know, cracking jokes over the corpse kind of stuff. <laughs> Anyways, uh, it's... Uh, it's entertaining and it's worth watching. 